What noise does a reindeer make? Probably. No. Christmas everyone welcome back to my channel I'm Melissa and today we're gonna get right into it <laughs> I can't even take myself seriously in this thing that's kind of hot too oh, look at my ears okay I love this time of year I love Christmas I love everything about it I love looking at Christmas lights decorating putting up the tree wrapping presents buying gifts all the holiday baking and cooking, and most of all, I love Christmas movies. Now, I don't know about most of you, but at least for myself, the day after Halloween, November 1st, that's when I get the Christmas decorations out of the garage, dust off the totes, and start decorating. My family hates it, they think I'm crazy, they try to commit me, but they can't catch me. I add the Christmas station to my radio in the car, I blast Christmas music, and everyone gets upset that I just kind of forget about Thanksgiving. But that's just the way it goes. You know, I'm not the only person who almost skips over Thanksgiving and goes straight to Christmas. Christmas cups come out in November. So, what do you think about that? So if I have to narrow it down to my top five Christmas movies, I definitely like the movie The Holiday with Kate Winslet, Cameron Diaz, Jude Law, and Jack Black. I really love any movie with Jack Black in it. But anyways, I really like that movie. I watch that every year. And then I would say my next bestest, favoritistist, favoritist? Okay, my next fave Christmas movie would be This Christmas. This Christmas is jam-packed with a lot of great actors. Just to name a few off the top of my head from that movie, there's Regina King, Idris Elba, Chris Brown, Loretta Devine. That is a really good movie. Check that out if you haven't seen it. Lots of drama, there's comedy, the heartwarming family goodness. Then I would say my third movie on my top five list would be Christmas with the Cranks and that has Tim Allen and Jamie Lee Curtis. That is a really good movie. I've never actually thought about skipping Christmas and going to Hawaii, but that is actually not a bad idea. However, I do live in Arizona and we experience warm weather about eight to nine months of the year. So the two and a half or three months that we do get cooler weather, I, I don't think I would wanna skip out on that and go to a warm climate. You know, I don't know, just saying. Second favorite Christmas movie on my list would be A Christmas Story. Man, that is just a classic movie. I remember watching that movie when I was a little girl and you know, seeing that movie really taught me some life lessons. Like for one, don't go and stick your tongue to a light pole on a cold day. And don't play with BB guns because you'll shoot your eye out. Don't say bad words because then you gotta eat soap. Let's run down the movies that I have listed. So we have The Holiday, This Christmas, Christmas with the Cranks, A Christmas Story, and then my favorite movie during the holiday time. I've already watched it four times this week. I love it. Elf with Will Ferrell. I know I said I love any movie with Jack Black, which is true. I do. I also love any movie with Will Ferrell. If you haven't seen any of the movies that I mentioned, I totally recommend checking out those movies. They're a definite must watch during the Christmas season. So to pay tribute to my favorite movie of the Christmas holiday season, Today's giveaway is this beautiful coffee cup that says, don't be a cotton-headed ninny muggins. 
And if you've seen the movie Elf, you will get the reference. And if you haven't, you should watch it so you do get the reference. So if you would like to win this really cute coffee cup, all you have to do is make sure that you're subscribed to my channel, like this video, drop me a comment below with how to get a hold of you, and then make sure you're following me on Instagram. And this cup shall be yours. There you go, super easy. Check back tomorrow for day three of the 12 days of Christmas holiday giveaway and see what I have in store for you. All right, until then, bye guys.